Hey everyone, Zayf here and welcome to Zero Keeper Overview. It feels so weird doing the intro when we didn't really get any new release in the past 2-3 weeks. Before December we were getting like multiple titles in one day so it feels a little bit awkward for me when I'm used to be just a workhorse here. So Zero Keeper seems to be a puzzle shooting adventure game. I guess something in a similar fashion than you know those mobile games when you destroy the blocks and score points based on the time you complete the level, as few moves as it's possible, you know that kind of thing. Besides Besides that this project claims to have some kind of zoo gameplay, mostly taking care of the animals, feeding them, interact with the environment, it kinda comes across as an Animal Cross-ish title. Essentially the premise is to rebuild the areas and fill them with attractions that's been there before. The concept itself isn't very complicated, it's just you get simple tasks to fulfill and take care of whatever is going on. I feel like the appeal of games with destroying blocks or stuff like that, they really work on mobile because you can pick it up easily like for a few minutes, just drop it then return after a few hours is this continuous gameplay that fits for like smartphones but VR even though it's considered as a mobile thing it's too hard to do for such a short period of time so like I'm not really sure if Zookeeper will be even appealing for us most likely for very casual people that enjoy peace and quiet leisure with virtual animals I don't know maybe it has some complicated mechanics we'll have to see you know I guess let's go to the zoo <laughs> Well, I already hate the game because it literally released when I was going for work. So, thanks for watching! <laughs> <sighs> what do we have here? Ow! Options, English, move left hand, puzzle shooter right hand. Wow, <laughs> simple as that. Once upon a time, there was a large zoo in this very place. Every day, people flocked to the zoo and then went home smiling. But as the months passed, fewer and fewer people visited the zoo. Until one day, the zoo closed down, never to be remembered. I would appreciate the subtitles. Make your way to the zoo owner. Please don't say it's just like that and not sp Make your way to the zoo owner. Smooth locomotion. Oh snap don't even mm -mm. I mean there was nothing in the options, so Oh god. Make your way to the zoo Ah good. I've been waiting for you. This place was once home to a zoo. A very large zoo. As the new zoo owner, I have invited you here today to help me rebuild the zoo. Now Follow me. Find the zoo owner and point at him. What's up with Japanese or like just Asian in general games for quests that have no smooth Find locomotion? It's lucky that we have teleport, but like I, I just don't understand the philosophy. Here's where you begin your work to rebuild the zoo. You are going to make me a monkey exhibit. Clear the mission to bring a monkey to the zoo. Shoot two or more connecting blocks of the same color to destroy them. Okay. Destroy the remaining blocks to clear the mission. Do you have like a set ammo or something? What's this? Okay. Not like it was challenging though. Great job! The zoo now has a monkey. He's the first animal back. Look at him! Livelier than a barrel full of monkeys. Monkey! Wait a minute. He's not lively at all. The monkey doesn't seem very happy with his new home. Work your magic and make it a more livable place for him. Clear the mission to spruce up the monkey exhibit. <laughs> okay, so that's the gameplay, I assume. See those monkeys? 
Keep destroying blocks until they fall through the floor. If you destroy many blocks at once, an item will appear. You did it! Oh no, there is ammo. 15. Okay. You can point at something far away to grab it. Toss the bananas near the monkey. Okay. Look at that grin on his face. A bunch of bananas is all you need to keep him happy. But is it really? The monkey looks a little lonely. Maybe it's time to find him a friend. And how do we do it? With a puzzle. <laughs> See those acorns? You can get rid of them by destroying the blocks touching them. Combo. <laughs> so see, here's a threshold of shots and the acquired stars you get if you want to pass the limit. to make her stomach that big. What? Clear the mission. <laughs> Simple as that. Try using an item when two items are touching each other. This will produce a much larger effect than usual. Which one do I pop first though? This one or this one? Whoa! A combination, okay. That was fun. Hmm. Damn. Because now they're getting harder. Nah, I'm just brain dead, that's it. Addicting. <laughs> Hasta la vista. Next 
puzzle. What's a star? Ah. Wow. You did I actually really like that there's this mechanic. Well, not only do we have a new monkey exhibit, we even have new monkey babies. You seem to have a knack for this job. Well, don't stop. Get to work on the next exhibit. It's the zoo map. You can use it to check where to go next or to retry a puzzle you've already cleared. Well, it's <laughs> actually kinda okay. The thing is that there's a weird discrepancy between the character models and the environment. Like, if the art style will be exactly the same all across the board, then graphically it will be pretty good. Because the gameplay is actually not bad, I mean, aside from smooth locomotion, which there's no excuse, it's 2021. If you don't bring variety in that category, then you're dead to me. <laughs> I feel like there is a potential, just with the cuteness and the zoo and exploring the world because it seems to be pretty big like we're just here but there's so many areas with different animals and stuff i'm not gonna do a playthrough but i can appreciate this game if the things that i mentioned will be worked on triangle flowers huh all right <laughs> see you